that you are here today. We will start our day by standing uh, for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Well, today is Thursday, August 17th, and it is a red day. As you know, I talked about it yesterday. Today is picture day makeup. So if you were here on registration and got your picture taken for the yearbook and um, your ID badge, then, or actually just the yearbook, then you do not need to take pictures today. This is not a retake day because you haven't received your pictures from August 2nd. It's just to make sure that we've gotten everyone to have at least one picture taken. And then later in September, we have a retake day. So students, this is only for um, those of you who didn't attend August 2nd. And teachers, Mrs. Brown is sending out a tentative schedule. And so we just, you will see on there kind of approximate times, but we'll gauge based on how many students uh, need to have their picture taken. We have plenty of time, it's a 20 minute segment, so it may be shortened. So if you're at the end, you could anticipate it could be 20 to 40 minutes before your scheduled time on there. We were just kind of giving you a ballpark. But teachers, I do need all of you to get your picture taken today, so, and staff members, so please make sure that you go in and get your picture taken. School lunch, another great day yesterday in the cafe. Thank you. Teachers, I've highlighted on this screen the prices for the lunches. And some of you have envelopes, the little white envelopes that the kids put their money in, in your classrooms from last year. And I need you to recycle those because the prices are different from last year to this year. So teachers, if you would make a note and just check your your envelopes, they should have $285 for a regular meal and $330 for the premium. So regular meal today is baked chicken um, or not ham. I didn't delete out ham, sorry. The meatball sub sandwich. We have au gratin potatoes, glazed carrots and peaches as the sides. Remember, you can get a milk and a juice or a milk or a juice. And then the premium meal is Asian chicken tenders or the burger bar. So the burger bar is in the place where the deli bar was, and the premium meal is on the international station. And remember, if you have our, um, a free or reduced lunch program person, that you can have any of the meals that are available. So just know that that is always an option. Then I thought, wouldn't it be interesting to know what a gratin means? And so when you go there and you're like, well, that's just kind of a funny name, um, you can see that based on this um, definition, it's sprinkled with bre breadcrumbs or grated cheese. And I really like au gratin potatoes. Actually, I like any kind of potatoes. But it is French, and au gratin is, actually means by grating. So meaning like you have grated cheese. So I thought that would be just a fun tidbit when we're in the cafe. I'll be quizzing you to see if you remember that. Solar eclipse. So you've probably been hearing lots about this. And it is on Monday. Teachers, um, team leaders, this flyer that needs to go home today is in the team leader's mailbox. So please make sure these get passed out to every student to go home today. Students, make sure your parents see this. They are getting some um, information from the district that you have received this and you need to give this to them. It talks about the information regarding the solar eclipse, the time frame, um, and we'll have more information tomorrow, but I wanna make sure everybody gets this home. The other thing is I want you to plan for your lunch. We're gonna have like a picnic lunch that day, but we'll pick up our lunches in the cafe and the two lunch choices are hot dog, plus sides and drinks, or a spicy chicken sandwich, plus sides and drinks. So if you don't care for either of those options, you need to bring your own sack lunch that day because that's what the cafe will have um, available. 
We will go outside. Each student and staff member will receive the proper glasses in order for us to view the eclipse safely. We'll go over all of the safety details. Um, one of the elements, I talked with the teachers last night, but one of the elements I did not, um, I think I failed to mention to the teachers is there are times we can be outside and not have the glasses on because we aren't looking directly into the sun. Just like every day that we're outside and it's sunny, you know not to look directly at the sun because that can cause permanent eye damage. Hurt your eyes, the sun's bright. So when we go out during the solar eclipse, um, the glasses have the special lenses so that when you're outside and you look at the sun, then it's safe. But you don't have to have them on when you're not looking um, at the sun so, or, or looking up. So we will go over those details tomorrow. But please make sure this information page gets sent. Hmm. Technology. So yesterday you should have received your laptop and a charger and a bag. And then this morning, teachers, the um, students have ha gotten the quiz that's pushed out into their email. As I have understood this, I haven't seen it uh, myself through a student's email, but that's what I've been told. Uh, first thing we need to do is get passwords reset. And then, teachers, it could be, I know Mr. Smith sent out, we want to do it tomorrow, but there are a few of you based on schedules for tomorrow that said, is there a possibility we could do it today? You, students, you have to take, um, go over some lessons and then take a quiz, uh, and we have to have that done by about the middle of next week, I think the 25th maybe. So that is an option, teachers, if you'd like to do that today and to, or tomorrow, that's fine, whichever works best in your schedule. One of the elements before I do birthdays is code of conducts. Teachers, please be reviewing that. I'd like to have all of those signed. Um, by tomorrow, so if you haven't had an opportunity to do that with the students, please make sure you're getting that in because next week we will do our discipline talks and send out the schedule for that. Okay, birthday, so I kind of messed up. I missed three birthdays yesterday. So Tamaya B of the Legends, happy birthday to you, a belated birthday, meaning just a little bit late. And Tristan B of the Legends, happy birthday to you yesterday. And Tristan F of the Olympians, happy birthday to you. Today we have Jocelyn G of the Phoenix, happy birthday, and Anna K of the Olympians. So make sure all of you get your birthday pencil from your home-based teacher. Today we do have a staff birthday, Miss Julie, who cooks our amazing vegetables in the cafe. It is her birthday, so please tell her happy birthday today. All right, today is day three. I want you to make today count, and please join me in our sign-off. It's a great day to be a tiger.